Continuing with Jenny's uh, mother's Swiss watch. This point. I'm going to remove the the train wheel bridge and the uh it may be the uh pallets bridge but we'll see here These are different size screws, so this screw, this screw from the uh, 9 o'clock hour of the watch just above the letter M on Madonna, I'm going to remove first. That is, I think, going to be the setting labor screw, but also I'm going to... The screw for the pallet forks it's a much smaller screw. This is all joined together. So I need to remove the final two screws here and here. which should release the um, tire plate. It's actually just really, you could call it a bridge, but it really is the top plate of the watch. So these two screws, I'm gonna have to compare to the other two screws. Now this should come off. release the darn spring on this watch. Mm. Well, it upsets me when that happens. I thought for sure I did. Obviously not. So we have this plate would be the barrel bridge. Barrel bridge goes with these two screws here. And the removal of the train wheel and pallet bridge. The it's important to note that this the pallets is a very long stem and it seats right here in the train of wheel bridge. And I'm getting too far away from the, almost to the edge of the camera, so sorry about that.
Oops. There is another tiny screw down here. Right here. It seems all of these screws may be different. They are. I'm going to have to draw a map of that. I'm going to take this plate off. So this should lift off. At that point, you'll be able to see the train of wheels. And I'm going to have to map this out. Do that off camera.